Georgia Bureau of Investigation Director Chris Hosey says he knows for many folks across the country, the University of Georgia is known for its football team as well as academic standards. But in recent days, the most important team in Athens has been the law enforcement team, whose work led to an arrest in the killing of Lake and Riley. Was there one key piece of information that started the dominoes falling toward an arrest? I would call it a collection of information, whether it be physical, not physical, verbal, whatever the case may be, that starts to point investigators in a direction and kind of snowballs from there. But it's critical that you handle that right or you could lose an opportunity. Absolutely. Resources went immediately. By the time I get that information, we have agents that are en route to the scene. We brought in resources from across the state. Not only our Athens Regional Office, but neighboring work units uh, sent manpower down, resources. We had digital forensic investigators, criminal intel analysts, uh, forensic artists. Immediately after uh, this incident took place, um, we notified our crime lab in Atlanta that they would be likely receiving evidence involved in this case. And uh, they were quick to be ready for it and to start process and analysis of the evidence that was brought. What aspects of the investigation was GBI involved in? In, in pretty much all of them, but working side by side with UGA Police Department, Athens, Clark County, but also state law enforcement personnel, Georgia State Patrol, Department of Community Supervision, uh, Georgia Department of Corrections uh, assisted as well. Hosey says he's been told UGA Chief Clark and Athens Clark County Chief Jerry Salters were homicide earlier in their careers, which probably helped. And Jesse Maddox, special agent in charge of the GBI Athens region, has extensive homicide experience. The GBI director says solving the case to bring resolve was important on many fronts. That's important for family. It's important for community. It's impor important for the citizens of this state. Uh, so that's why it's not a hard decision to throw resources at it. That's why it's not a hard decision to work hand-in-hand with University of Georgia Police and Athens-Clark County in this team effort.